Hello everyone, this is going to be a tarot reading for the sign of Pisces for April 2021 to see why their crush, their love interest, their soulmate isn't communicating with them right now. So let's see, Pisces, Pisces April 2021, why isn't their soulmate speaking to them right now? <clears throat> Why, what's the situation right now for Pisces and their love interest? Why isn't there communication between them? So, Pisces, <clears throat> you know what? I'm um, from what I'm getting here. There, there is communication. I, either there is communication, but not as much as you would want it to be. Or this um, period uh, of not speaking is actually temporary. Um, I don't think this is going to be long-lasting based on the three cards I get here. It could be that someone is... Gen Someone here, very likely them, since you are the one watching this reading, uh, is um, is uh, busy elsewhere. You know, busy with life in general. But um, I, 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 as I said, I think this separation is temporary, and especially if you are going to be the one who reaches out to this person, um, then communication is uh, is going to resume. All right, so let's see. Why, um, uh, no, how does this uh, person see Pisces? How does their soulmate, their crush, how does this person see Pisces? Um, they see that um, the good times are, are over. <laughs> um, in general, they have a very good positive attitude towards you, but there's definitely been uh, some sort of um, problem here between the two of you, and it caused some pain either to you or to them. Uh, but uh, the fact that this card is appearing with the Sun card, the Ten of Swords is with the Sun card, is um, indicates two things, two good things. First of all, that... Um, this person still sees you in a favorable light because you know sometimes if we have a fallout with someone we see them all negative no this person hasn't forgotten the good times um that uh you two had together um and uh, the second thing is that this person still believes that this could be worked out because the sun card is a card that illuminates any other card of uh, of the deck so um yeah there's been this you know painful um time and interaction between the two of you but they still have optimism that you can work this out all right, so let's see, how does this person feel? How does this person feel about Pisces? Please tell me, how does this person feel about Pisces? Yeah, I told you they're going to um, reach out. Uh, they're feeling about reaching out, but they still haven't uh, brought themselves to do so. They, they do have to urge to communicate with you but for the time being they'd rather stay low for whatever reason and I'm getting really strong stalker vibes from here from uh, these cards so I do think this person is uh, not just thinking about you but keeping an eye on you um, they're stalking your social media I, I, I hope it's just that and they're not actually stalking you outside your home or anything because that's quite creepy but um, for sure, they're keeping an eye on your social media profile. And you know what? I, I really feel that this person might have even made some sort of fake account and actually contacted you, you know, because I see contact, but someone who is dishonest. 
So if you if you've been contacted or if you are going to be contacted by this random stranger, <laughs> just so you know, Pisces, it's not really a stranger at all. <laughs> all right. So um, let's see. Uh, what are this person's intentions towards you? What are this person's intentions towards Pisces in April 2021? What are their intentions? Yeah, they want to talk to you and get back with you and uh, get back to the good old days with you. It, 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 this person, this reading is so transparent. It, like I can even tell. Uh, what it is even before I laid out the cards. It's exactly what I said earlier. So this person wants to make up with you. This person wants to resume communication with you. I told you this period of not talking is just temporary. <clears throat> and uh, this person wants to have better times with you. You know, move past this heartbreak that um, happened here. And, um, and, um, go towards calmer waters, towards better times, you know, back to the good old days and so on. Uh, it's even likely that this person might invite you somewhere, uh, somewhere on a trip, somewhere on a date. <clears throat> but I see it as a, an invitation for traveling, you know, going somewhere. So, uh, yeah, these are their intentions uh, towards you. Now, let's see the outcome. What's going to happen? between Pisces and this person, their soulmate, their crush, uh, from now until um, the end of April and, uh, and within the next 30 days. What's going to happen between Pisces and this person within the next 30 days? Yep, you're getting back together. You're getting back together, but just so you know, there are going to there there's going to be some dryness in this relationship. I'm under the impression that when you two get back together for a while at least, um, you're gonna have your guard up, either you or them. <clears throat> you're going to go through this period of uh, assessing the other and uh you know feeling the room let's uh, let's say uh and um being quite defensive uh with each other so um you might not actually get back together like straight away as a couple but more like have contact with each other go out and so on speak to each other but measure to see on what terms is the other how the other is feeling and acting towards the other you know there might be uh, some defensiveness as i said um but one of you is going to beg the other eventually to get back with them <laughs> I, I know you're thinking, that's not me, I'm not going to do that. Well, if you know for sure you're not going to do it, to do that, then it's them who is going to do it. Um, maybe not in actual, actually begging, but I see it as begging, okay? <laughs> so, uh, I don't know how they're going to phrase it and, or how they're going to act, but there there is going to be... Uh, some sort of really strong, um, you know, um, ask, desire to ask the other, please get back with me, please, let's get over this, please, you know. So uh, <clears throat> that's what I see uh, for you, Pisces, in the tarot cards. Now let's try a reading with the other cards to see what they have to say. Um... I'm going to lay out a spread for you that's going to give me an exact yes or no uh, answer to the question, is there going to be communication between Pisces and this person they're thinking about in April 2021? 
please tell me yes or no is there going to be communication between pisces and this person they're thinking about in april 2021 um there's not much to explain when i lay the cards for this particular spread so you're going to have to be a bit patient until i finish doing it you can go ahead and leave me a like on this video if you've liked the video and the reading so far um go ahead and subscribe to my channel if um you would like to see some more videos from me and enjoy the visuals of of the cards because these are uh, this is a set of cards that has a very beautiful illustration So, Pisces, um, the answer for you is that no, there isn't going to be communication in April and 2021. It's going to happen one month after that. So, possibly towards the end of May. Okay? So, it's not going to be this month. It's going to be middle of may towards the end of may that time frame okay so don't expect the communication soon communication is going to happen but not this month <clears throat> uh now let's see some more details what other details i can give to pisces Oh, okay, so Pisces, right off the bat, I see a loss here, but it's not your loss, it's someone else's loss. So I'm under the impression that this person, while they're not talking to you, they might be entertaining someone else. Um, I don't really see it as a relationship. I see it, though, as um, communication and meetings be between uh, your, your crush and this other person. But they were disappointed by them for whatever reason. <laughs> they couldn't find better, is what I'm trying to say. Now... Some other things I see here is that you, possibly, very likely you, not them, uh, you're going to have some problem with some authority figures, institutions, um, th that has absolutely nothing to do with your love spread, but I'm seeing it here and uh, I felt that maybe you... Uh, are going to be interested in it uh, you're going to have some problems from with these authorities uh, whatever it is that you want at first they're going to give you a negative answer but then soon afterwards they're going to give you a positive answer that is going to be very good for you financially i don't know what it is you're either asking for a promotion at work uh, or i don't know a loan from the bank whatever it is eventually you know very soon after that rejection the answer is going to come back positive okay so let's see some more details for pisces uh 
Okay, so for the male Pisces watching this, the male Pisces watching this is going to, um, w once you reconnect with this person you're uh, thinking about, um, you're going to meet up with them very likely in your home or in their home but the initial encounter between the two of you is not going to be positive and i'm under the impression that th this person is going to appear fake toward uh, to you for whatever reason um either they're going to seem like they're too sweet uh, in order to want to get back to you or they're lying to you or that's the the initial encounter you when once you do reconnect with this person is that's that's what your impression is going to be of them that um uh, they're fake somehow okay um you're going to meet them on a day trip yeah during the day and it's very likely that this person you're interested in is um a woman with light colored um eyes and uh, skin uh possibly on the heavier side she's more curvy she's not thin okay now for the female pisces watching this uh, you're gonna get an invitation from this person um, yeah once you reconnect with them as I said more towards the the end of May you're going to get an invitation from this person to go out with them somewhere at night time okay the males are meeting them at daytime but the female Pisces are meeting them at uh, at night time and um, it's very likely that this person is very interested in sleeping with you. Just got to be real. And that's what I see here. And uh, I think in your case, the person you're dealing with is someone with dark hair. Dark colored hair, maybe even a, a slightly darker complexion too. Yeah, but you're going to receive news and it's going to make you very happy uh when you hear from this person in in your case female pisces when I, I said earlier for the male pisces that when when they meet them they're gonna come across as fake well in your case when you meet them they're going to come across as honest and authentic and um they're going to tell you that they've been thinking about you okay so um that was it the reading with these cards now let's pull some messages from spirit as well so i'm going to pull three messages and you're going to have to pick one so let's see what does pisces need to hear what does pisces need to hear right now pisces what do they need to hear the first pisces what does pisces need to hear the second And the third message. Go ahead and pick one using your intuition. Okay, so let's see. For the first group, priorities. Um, yeah, get your life in order, Pisces. Well, you know, don't don't hang around and wait for this person to contact you. Don't put them uh, number one in your life um see what else it's important to you and don't hang around waiting uh, for them all right for the second keep your eyes open mm, this might be the people who i've said earlier when you meet the the person again and you speak to them they're going to come across as fake uh so make sure you do keep your eyes open i i did see that person interested in resuming the love connection with you and all but there might be something there that you might have overlooked okay and for the third group details change everything yeah in uh, in your case um there might be something that you've missed too that you haven't noticed until uh, until now uh, pisces so uh, think about it 
Okay, so that was it. That was the reading, the tarot reading for Pisces in April 2021. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give me a like. Um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and you'd like to watch more videos. Um, I wish you good luck with your situation. And I'll see you in my next videos. Bye for now.